The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. It speaks of his greatness and tells of his love. And each day at dawning I lift my heart high. I raise up my eyes to the infinite sky. I watch the night vanish as a new day is born. And I hear the birds sing on the wings of the morn. I see the dew glisten in crystal-like splendour. While God, with a touch that is gentle and tender, wraps up the night and softly tucks it away. He hangs out the sun to herald a new day. And so I give thanks and my heart kneels to pray. God, keep me and guide me. Be with me today. A reminder from Eleanor Steiner Rice of the wonders of God's creation. The amazing things that he does. And so as we come together to worship, we realise that as life throws us many curved balls, as life takes so many twists and turns, God is still with us and hears us when we talk to him. Who would have imagined a year ago that we would still be having worship online? I remember the first service I ever did on here and how terrified I was at the technology of it that has now become second nature to many of us. Who would imagine that Zoom would play such an important part in our lives? And whoever would have thought that we would need to consult the Encyclopedia of COVID-19 regulations before we planned an event? Throughout all the changes in our lives, God has remained part of the bigger picture. He's never left us alone. He's always walked alongside us and he will continue to do so ready to catch us when we flounder or stumble, ready to listen, for he always hears our prayer. I invite you now to join together in our first hymn. Be still and know that I am God. <laughs> 